A woman from Columbia City died in what police think was a meth lab explosion. News Channel 15's Alyssa Ivinson was the only reporter there this morning as crews were taking the lab apart. It was an early morning for police in Whitley County. I can't believe it. 1 a.m., a neighbor calls police saying a woman is hurt inside this home in the Miami Village Mobile Home Park. So I went boom. We just heard a, a boom. Police think that boom was a meth lab exploding. They spent the morning pulling out meth materials. This is the first we heard about meth lab. One officer told News Channel 15 this was a one-pot method lab. When uh, the one-pot method is uh, cooking, uh, uh, there is pressure that is uh, generated, and if the pressure isn't released within the container, the pressure can become enough where it will, in fact, explode. While News Channel 15 was reporting live on First News, police brought out 24-year-old Alicia Stein's body. Officers found her dead on the master bedroom floor. The explosion sent glass flying. Shards hit Stein in the neck, throat, and arm. She also had chemical burns on her face. I was very surprised. My kids were in the back room sleeping, actually, when it happened. It's really scary. Not only what she was doing, but the strangers that could have come in and out and having children close. Neighbors say Stein had just moved in here about a month ago, and they don't know a whole lot about her, but they did see a lot of people coming and going. I don't know what they were doing. I just seen a bunch of people. People come and go and you think nothing of it and then find out something like that. That's nuts. Police broke windows to air out the toxic chemicals while they worked inside, leaving crews to spend the rest of the morning putting up boards. In Columbia City, Alyssa Ivinson, News Channel 15.